Wow, you can't help but be affected by that. It's highlighting the issue of domestic violence, but also puts 911 dispatchers in the spotlight. The now's Kristen Scovera spent time today with a dispatcher in Arvada, realizing they really are on the front lines of life and death. 911, operator 901, where's the emergency? It's the call no one wants to make. But when lives are on the line, the emergency dispatcher is the very first responder. University PD is on scene, requested an emergent response, uh, unknown injuries. The most satisfying aspect of the job is being able to be that first line of help. Ian Scott is a 911 dispatch lieutenant at Rural Metro's emergency call center in Arvada. You're talking to people on their worst day or one of the worst days of their lives and you're doing everything you can to try and make that a little bit better. He's calm, cool and collected. An obvious side effect of years spent on the job and on the phone. It is a big part of it to remain calm and even toned. Um, you do want to be somewhat empathetic as well. Ian says watching this year's Super Bowl ad hits very close to home. I'd like to order a pizza for delivery. Ma'am, you've reached 911. This is an emergency yeah, line. Uh, large with half pepperoni, half mushroom. It, it is very chilling and it's uh, something that brings to light what both sides of the conversation people go through. Ian and his fellow dispatchers field dozens of calls every day and say they fine-tuned their listening skills. As a dispatcher, a call taker, you really need to hear what's going on more than just the words that are said. Ian says he hopes the ad raises awareness about domestic violence and encourages people to place the call. It looks like I have an officer about a mile from your location. Wow. Kristen Scovera now live in the newsroom. And Kristen, that is so much responsibility on their shoulders. They really do save lives. Absolutely. The dispatchers are answering calls all day, all night, working very long shifts. It's a world very few of us get to see, but we're always glad when they pick up the phone and help us get through those stressful situations. All right, Kristen. Thanks. Great story. Let's get back out to Andrew.